Hey guys, welcome back to the phone game video tutorial. This is Abhishek. Today we're gonna talk about how we can get the organization details from a single contacts or the multiple contact lists. Okay, uh, so let's start the example. Here I have created a very simple example uh, in which I have created a device ready event in which I have created I want to find one contact with the organization you have to specify the organization keyword okay you'll get all these keywords from the uh, phonegap.com uh, tutorial phonegap uh, from the website of a phone gap official website of the phone gap they have displayed all the details of the contacts which fills what will get you back to uh, as a result okay here uh, I have just created a simple example uh, I'm gonna return the display name as well as the organizations right uh, if I got the return uh, of a contacts then I'll find a organization detail within that contact list within that single contact okay so if I get a multiple contacts then I'll get a multiple organizations from the multiple contact lists so right now I am just running these applications here you, you will get only single alert okay for the first contact right uh, I hope you guys have uh, knows how we can get a multiple uh, uh, or, uh, multiple organization details of the multiple contact list there is only single options you have to specify the option dot multiple is equals to true otherwise you will get only a single contact every time when you run this application so, okay right now I will got the all the contact list because I haven't set any filter on this the filter is blank so I'll get all the written contacts so this is the first oops multiple m u l t i p l e let me alert this Hey guys, watch this. You will get most of the, I think, all the contacts from the contact list. Okay, but you will not get the organization's details because I haven't set uh, the organization uh, details in my contact list. So, first I need to set that, and after that, we'll come here. So, here in my uh, Let me check this. Creative consulting. Okay, still I am getting a single context. Mm. Let me check which contact is that. Mm, 
yeah this is the kid will producer creative consulting there is not any this okay let me set the filter it's a blank that means no filter I'll get the detail then uh, let me find out the name is blue soap title is this type is null preference is false department is mobile development but where is the organization detail It's a blue soft department is uh, mobile development title is SR mobile developer right guys but uh, still I'm not getting the multiple contact lists okay I think I'm missing something so let me remove this and uh, options dot multiple equals to true then find Filter is okay. Success. Alert. Session dot stringify. Contacts of I. Okay. And here, run this. Okay, I'll get a single ID that is the display name null Kate. If you check uh, the organizations, here is the organizations I'm getting that, and uh, if I specify the Abhishek, and I'm not getting the organization, right? I still I'm getting the organizations I'm getting the name I'm getting the title type okay I'm not getting the type right guys so let me assign that type to the contact but let me check the before the kit type is also null preference false department null okay Here, the organization's dot length it becomes zero. Just wait a second. Yeah, guys. Uh, I think uh, we have made some mistakes over here because uh, if you mm, alert the contacts of I dot organizations, then uh, then uh, you will get the blank null value, and uh, it's uh, stopping at the time. See, I'll get a first object, then I'll get a second or a second contact null, so it stops the executions further. So for that, to remove that, you have to check a condition over here. That is, if we get the organization, then only we're gonna fetch the organization detail. Otherwise, this condition become false, will not go further. Okay. For uh, getting the uh, organization details, uh, I think still we have missing something. So contacts of I dot organizations. 
okay and then okay uh this is okay and after that here i have to specify a condition call contacts of i dot organizations this is the starting brackets and this is the ending brackets now let's check uh, how much organizations will get this is the first organization after that this is the second organization after that this is the third that's me and after that okay we got a three organization details okay uh, i hope you have uh, enjoyed uh, this tutorial thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe my channel for more video uh, for more video tutorials related to phone gap thank you for uh, thank you bye bye